Don't forget to subscribe to my channel Sephra Korea and hit the bell icon for regular notification. Hello everyone and I'm back with another video and today I'm going to prepare the lady fish which is called Kane in Konkani and I had some masala remaining so I've already added it but it's not sufficient enough so I'll tell you what all ingredients I'll be using to marinate this fish and I'm going to make fish fry so add ginger garlic paste so the measurements will be mentioned in the description box you can refer to that add some red chili powder I want it spicy so I've added a little more quantity add a little of pepper powder salt to taste there was a little masala remaining from the previous fish that I fried so I just mix this into this little bit of garam masala you can also add uh, the cumin and the coriander powder dry powder dhaniya jire powder but uh, you can also add the garam masala it depends on your choice so let me add the turmeric powder and uh, to marinate you always require something acidic you can use vinegar you can use uh, tamarind water or lime and the masala which i added previously had little bit of tamarind water in it so now i'll add little bit of lime little bit of lime juice so if you want this masala you can just add lime juice or tamarind water vinegar so previously this masala was remaining I didn't want to waste it and so I added it mix all this well and let it marinate if you are marinating it for a longer time for 1-2 hours then you can keep it in the fridge but if you are frying it soon then you can just keep it for around 20 minutes outside just mix it well I'll just cover this and let it be for around 20 minutes so it's marinating for quite some time now so I've taken a, a mix of semolina and uh, rice flour semolina is rava and mix this well you can just fry it directly but you can also give a coating of uh, rava semolina because it makes it crispy I've kept the pan for heating and I'm going to add some oil add sufficient quantity of oil and let it be on high flame let the oil get heated up and I'm going to coat this reduce the flame to medium mm. so just let me fry this four I'll put another one let the pan not get too crowded just add 5 just add some more oil 
it should not get dried up because it may get burnt so and let it fry at medium to low heat So almost one and a half minutes frying, and let me turn this. Don't fry it excess, so that it will be it gets burnt. But this color is just fine. It should fry golden brown, nice and crispy. And this. Again, frying for two to three minutes. We just check. Let it be for another half a minute. Want it more crispy. And I'll add little bit of oil, very little. I'm using coconut oil for frying. Coconut oil is more preferred than vegetable oil. So let it be a little more crispy. Yeah, I think it's done. And now it's time to remove it. I think this will make a very good starter and this reminds me of the silver fish those small tiny silver fish when it is fried in the same manner it makes a very good starter and that can be eaten with the thorns just like uh, finger chips they become so tiny and so nice so add some oil I'll be showing many recipes in my upcoming videos. So, lot of variety of content on my channel. Don't forget to check my channel with all my recipes and my DIYs. I make craft DIY videos, best of waste, craft for kids and uh, science classes online teaching and recipes i do sometimes vlogging and there will be a lot of variety of content coming up in my channel so if you haven't subscribed to my channel and you're new to watching my videos then don't forget to subscribe to my channel So done. Second batch of the fish fry. And it's ready. The crispy rava fry. Lady fish. It's called Kane. And they also make curry out of this. But rava fry tastes very nice so crispy and you can uh, follow this similar procedure this recipe for other fish fry recipes 
and also you will find a lot of content on my channel of variety of fish recipes so you can uh, always check for some recipes and subscribe to my channel and share it with everyone so this looks so yummy and tasty it looks good i think it will taste good also so i will see you all in my next videos till then bye